Hey, 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 it's Lisa, the fossil finding female. And boy, have I found a lot of different stuff. These were already here. Just look at all those I need to go through. Wowzer. <laughs> and then I have a huge bag here that is something I'm like interested in looking at all these different things that I think possibly uh, were tools, some of them. Um, boy, I just have so much. I, I want to show everybody all this cool stuff. I hope everyone's doing well. Today is 11 15 22. It's cold here in New Mexico, but it's not wet like it is in uh, Alabama. So I am back home. Got home safe and sound. Two day drive, kind of far and long drive, but finally got the death certificate. And there's a lot more to do, so I'll probably be going back, but not right away. Um, these are the things I found um, while I was gone. Quite a few. I know. And they look like they have been, like they were a tool of some sort. But we don't know. We weren't here. Now what are we? <laughs> It's also fascinating to me, the things that you can find just looking down on the ground. And I do believe they're not telling us everything because that allows for a power differential. That being the controllers of the world, you know what I mean? So some of the things that I find, I do feel like they were actually something biological, not all of them, but some of them, and tools as well, even though they were used also like the biological tools like bones and they carved knives and arrowheads and all that kind of stuff out of them. I did find an arrowhead this trip and I was right next to my dad's house. I was pretty excited about that. I will show you once I locate that. So many, so many things I found. Let's see what we got here. Lots of different materials. not really sure what all the materials are. I planned on looking them up. I have a book about minerals and uh, fossils and things like that. I want to look them up and see if I can kind of identify some of these. If you guys know, please let me know. Comment. Um, and if you'd prefer me to show you a different way, you know, comment. Let me know because it's all new to me. I just thought, well, heck, I want to share with the YouTubers and... Uh, learn from them as well what they find and where they're at and where they find it and all that cool stuff be with like-minded people you know what i mean jelly beans or you do boo -boo uh this is very light it's kind of a a greenish color But it looked like it, they possibly used it for a tool. If you see right there where that little point is here. There's a point there too. So I don't know. And we may never know. But it's still cool looking at things. And just this looks like a tool too to me. See how it has the point right there. smooth so I guess they could have done you know like drawing or carving or something with it something something pretty cool stone let's see what other goodies we have I know I can't go through this whole bag but it's fun this is the best part is to go come home and look at all your finds pick out the best ones That's an interesting, and this again, I think is the same as this here, same material. Got to clean them up. I still haven't washed them. That's unlike me. I usually like to wash my stuff. But it's getting dark. It's getting, see that also looked like a little tool right there. It's all pointy. It's getting dark, 
And so I thought while I was out here trying to load, unload all of them out of my vehicle, my truck was full of them. <laughs> Definitely get my work out that way. Again, this to me looks like a tool. I thought I'd go ahead and show some of these with my little Android phone here. Works pretty good. I, don't, I can't put some cards at the end or some like go check out this video or whatever, but it's pretty quick and I'm even able to um, edit with the phone. I'm much simpler than with my computer, my camera and my computer. It's crazy how that works. Let's see here. Hello, everybody. How are you? <laughs> it's a crazy face in there. Do you see what I see? Yeah. Not crazy. It also, you know, could be something underneath all of this. I've seen some other people get some and break open the stuff around it and get crabs and stuff out of it. I might try to do that. I do have some that I think are geodes, which I'm going to go to my friend's house and have him cut them open for me. What do you think this is? If you had it in your hand, you'd probably be able to tell. It is a piece of wood. It's very, it's hard, but it's real light. But interesting looking um, piece of wood, ain't it? It won't break, but it feels like it should break. It absolutely feels like a piece of wood. All right, let's see what else. Hmm. This one was also, it's very heavy. It's got some like blue in here. Some of these I just want to crack open, slice open, and see what the heck they are in the middle because you'd be quite surprised. I know I was on the ones I broke open, sliced open. They were wow. So I'm going to do a video on that fairly soon. Pretty cool. And let's see this one. This one's interesting too. It's got some different stuff in here. It looks like a purplish color. With a little band that's going around. See how it goes all the way around? I'm not sure um, what that could be, but. Right there. Looks like a purple stone of some sort. It's purple. But it does go all the way around it. So that might be something we need to check into. The bottom of it, they all, it's just interesting. Interesting. I don't know how good you guys can see this on this Android because me looking at it through the phone just doesn't look very good. So it might not look as good with you guys too. This looked like there was it was something, the imprint here, but I'm not sure either. Might just be a rock. By God. <laughs> Okay, let's see what else we got in here. It looks like it has a whole lot of stuff in it. Just kind of a conglomerate of stuff in that one. This one oop, almost fell over. Oops, squatting down. Raindrops are falling on my head. Ah! <laughs> I 
Rather interesting, don't you think? I think so. Okay, there's... I know there's got to be some better ones in here. I always like these little, like, squares. It's pretty cool. Square rock. Just a nice square rock. And this looks like a tool to me as well. You can see how it is sharp up at the end here. Pretty cool. I don't know what they would use it for. Do you guys know? If you do, please comment let me know. And if you guys have um, a channel, let me know what channel, and I'd love to go like and subscribe and see your stuff. That'd be great. So many interesting things. See the band running through that? Right there. It's kind of like a green band. You can see even like some green stuff all through there. I don't know if you can see it that well. Pretty cool. We're at 12 minutes. I'll probably stop at 15. That's long enough. And I'm going to do a video every day. I have enough to do them for years. I mean, years. <laughs> and I need to start building my uh, earth home again. It's just sitting here getting all leafed up and dang it. Put all these, put a lot of these into that earth home. It'll be really cool. Can't wait. And I will video it, but it'll probably be on the um, ZZ Easy channel that I have. Yeah, I have a ZZ Easy Y uh, channel. That's where I try to do better, be better, and share it with you. And then I have exercise with me. Just 10 minutes a day, you'll feel better. So check those channels out if you haven't already, if they interest you at all. And I started doing the ZZ Easy one. That was my first one. Um, and it was just kind of different things I liked. And then I got a couple strikes for talking about hydrogen peroxide. And uh, strangely enough. So um, I am an ER nurse. Um, stopped doing that when the COVID hit. But anyway, I was talking about some different things that could help heal you. Uh, and I got a strike. So I decided to branch out to some different ones so that I, the other channels didn't suffer while I had to be in a uh, YouTube jail. So check those out if you like and uh, like and subscribe if you like. Comment please. And again, thanks for joining me. We have another minute or so. Here's just a conglomerate. I like picking these up too. And I'm th sometimes I will, this has just some curious, it looks like it has peanuts in it, you know. Who knows? It could be poop. A dinosaur poop. What do they call that again? Um, oh, I forget what it's called. Darn it. Anyway, this is just cool looking, you know, whether it's anything special or not. I like the way it looks. It's cool to see all the different things that different states I stopped in. Texas, I stopped in Arkansas. Arkansas had some really cool ones. I can't wait to show you those. And I stopped in Oklahoma. More cool stones to find and fossils. Tools. Just cool looking stones regardless. And also stopped in Tennessee. Another, it looked like it's been worked here. Maybe, maybe not. And one last one, I think. There's a cool, interesting one there. Anyway, it's, uh, it's 15 minutes now, so I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, and I shall see you tomorrow. Again, thanks for watching.
Adios.